What's up, Stripe Nation? Blake Alberts here, B&B Long Care. I have the new FSA 130R on a backpack battery. We're gonna see if it can cut down weeds that are literally taller than me. Let's try it out. Today I finally get my new microphone, so the audio quality is finally gonna get better. It's been like a few weeks now, it's driving me crazy, but we're here. I don't show you this a lot, because I wanna keep it a little bit safe and secure, and I don't want all my information out there. Um, but uh, this is like our little shop, if you will. Uh, so I'm gonna clean up this open trailer. It's uh, it's just be kind of came a junk trailer with shovels and mulch and wheelbarrows and everything's filled with water, and because um, we've been getting mulch dumped, so we basically just have this bring this. It's got a little bit of extra mulch, but it's got our tools and wheelbarrows and stuff. So I'm gonna clean that up a little bit. I keep this stuff, just stuff like this. I'll show you. When we get back over there, but this stuff is in my trucks, man. Gloves, things to cut roots, and everything, man. You gotta keep everything in your trucks. Alright, Shurkian sent me this. It's a utility multi-purpose transfer tank. I just put water in here and it comes with like a spigot. And I don't know, that stuff started giving me like a rash here. So I rinsed it off and it because it was itching. I don't know. It's nice to have water. You can wash your hands, wash wash dirt off and things, but we're here at this uh we're gonna trim these weeds. I have my new FSA 130R and then the backpack I'm using is an AR3000L. Super excited about this stuff. My goodness. It's so sweet, dude. It's even got like a USB you could trim and charge your phone. Dude, I bet this thing would keep your phone charged for like a month. All right, let's try it out. manually cut this because this is I don't like the the line that comes in these trimmers when they're brand new I need to switch it out but I don't have the lawn care trailer here with me they're out mowing man I'm making money and they're not even close to me so I can't go get more string mm -hmm. It's so nice to just be able to wrench your hands off this cool little invention. Smart innovation, man, to come out with that and the little uh, spigot there during coronavirus so we can all wash our hands. Smart, man. This is a gas can company thinking outside 
of the box, dude. I like that. All right, I'm gonna try this new blower. This is crazy, man. Check this out. All of that trimming, full charge. That battery is ridiculous, dude, because any other battery powered trimmer, I think would be dead after all that. That's, that stuff was thick, man, and tall, overgrown. All right, I'm gonna blow this stuff off. So basically what I want to do is have like a steel section, maybe like a DeWalt section, maybe a Milwaukee section, I don't know. Of course you've got to have the double stroller for the daily walks. Uh, we've got the snow blowers lined up and I also left a little bit of room so I could walk over there and get, you know, shovels or whatever. Um, got a mower here. And then this is the area that I don't know what to do with this stuff. I'm going to have to find ways. I need to get a couple more hangers up there so like the stuff in that little area will be hung and then uh, i'm gonna clean this area up so i wanted to get all this mess there was just crap all over here so we got all that taken care of cleaned up thrown away or put elsewhere and this stuff you know looks looks semi good i picked up this bench um i don't know what this is but I picked up this bench. I might need to get another one. I don't know exactly what I want to do over here, uh, but I want to be able to work over here and do, and do some stuff. So I might slide this over and clean up that area and then have two workbenches or something like that. But this is the last little bit of my, this was all just a mess. And there was like tools and everything just on the ground everywhere. So this is my last little bit of mess, and uh, which is good. So... We're getting there. I'm actually super happy. And it might look like a mess still, but I'm happy with it because it's a little bit more organized, a little bit more functional. There's not just crap everywhere. We blew out the grass and the mud everywhere. And uh, I don't know. This is this is it, man. When, when you've got a lot of stuff and not a lot of space, um, this, is, this is the best you get. So there it is. All right, all showered and clean. What's up, Natalie? Hi. Everybody talks about you and wants to see you more often, but she's busy with these two monsters. All showered clean, eating a little feta. Tortellini. Tortellini Alfredo. Alfredo. Alfredo is my favorite. Besides pizza, Alfredo sauce is my favorite thing in the world. Natalie, you looking cute as a little single mom. Or, why do I say single mom? I mean, stay at home mom. Stay at home mom. I always say that, don't I? Yeah. Stay I can at home mom. Single mom. A single, yeah, it'd be really difficult. So, I always say that. Like, you do. that'd be the craziest experience because you'd have to work, you'd have to take care of the babies. These guys are like literally 24 7, you're on the clock. They've actually been really good today. But look, man, hey, sit back so that everybody <laughs> can see you. Sit back so everybody can see you. Dude, the kids are growing up so fast. You guys have kids, if you're going to have kids, if you're pregnant, whatever, take lots of pictures because I saw a puppy today, a four-month-old golden doodle, and it was so cute, and I literally don't even imagine Hazley that size, but she was smaller. I mean, she was tiny, like 12 pounds, mm -hmm. and now she's a monster. So take pictures, take videos. That's what we're doing. That's it. We're going to eat dinner, and uh, that's it. Take care, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.